Patrick, thank you. You and your staff did an incredible job putting on this cancer summit. And thank you to E18 Studios and all the IFF staff for the great work they've done to put this summit on. And our partners in Coronado Springs and the stagehands and all the work that you've done. I want you to know, as a Boston firefighter, Commissioner Finn ordered me to shave as soon as I get home. Um, we have a great challenge in front of us. You know, when I came on 20 years ago, it was accepted that cancer was part of our job. That if you were lucky enough to get through a career as a firefighter without being injured or killed, there was pretty good odds it was cancer that was going to get you in the end. You know, as we have this conversation, what a great day today was as we forge forward towards changing that reality. We can have conversations at, if you will, 10,000 feet. But it's also very personal. You know, Commissioner Finn mentioned the fire at the site power plant. I got relieved 10 minutes before that box came in. My truck went out the door and went to that fire as the third due truck. Every guy in that video is a friend of mine. I've worked with them. A lot of the guys on the wall were great friends of mine. Fought fires with them. This is about us. This is about our families and the impact that the sacrifice that we're required to make in the performance of this job has on our families. And you know, I just really, really, from the bottom of my heart, like to thank our industry partners who teamed up with us to help tackle this difficult issue with Tim Carter and Gorin Associates and MSA uh, as well as DuPont for stepping up and joining us and caring about us. Now today we heard from scientists, doctors, architects, attorneys, the wealth of intelligence that's being invested in saving our lives deserves an equal effort from us as firefighters to drive the change we need to tackle this very difficult issue. In order for you to drive change in your firehouse, you have to be strong. But you're a firefighter. We fight for a living. We die for strangers. We should sure fight to make sure that we're taking care of each other and making sure we're doing everything we can to make sure it's not our family that's impacted by the loss that cancer robs people. Cancer, as my friend Bobby Halton pointed out to me earlier today, cancer sucks. Cancer's bad. Why would we not stand up and fight for each other? You need to be strong. You need to be you. You need to be a firefighter to take this challenge on. So let's do it. Let's be change agents. Let's tackle this issue. Thank you, and God bless. Safe home, everybody.